morning, everybody. It's day 11. I still can't speak, but I am feeling a little bit better today. Uh, Gordon from Hustle Around the Bend just dropped me off at Dick's Creek Gap. So the plan today, I want to do about four and a half miles to meet up with my friend Alex again. And then if all goes according to plan, we should cross our first border into North Carolina today. So that's really exciting. And um, obviously something that I've been looking forward to. So I'm ready, ready to see that and uh, pretty excited for that. Um, I've still been taking my allergy medicine and uh, I think it's helping. Like I said, I feel pretty okay. I just sound terrible. Um, but today's the first day back on trail in a couple days. So we'll see how I'm feeling at the end of the day. Hopefully, hopefully it'll be okay, <laughs> but we'll see. And also I just wanted to say, um, I did a Nero and a Zero at Hustle Around the Bend. And Lisa and Gordon are just spectacular and uh, they're so accommodating and you can tell they really have a heart for hikers. So if anybody is hiking or in the area, I highly recommend going to stay with them because uh, it just it just feels like home when you're there. So definitely go check them out if you're uh, planning on hiking. Back in the rotos we go. There was a really nasty thunderstorm last night. And I was even getting kind of scared from the bunk room at the hostel. That's how bad it was. And I was just like, man, I sure am glad I'm not in my tent right now. AT looking nice and moody this morning. Honestly, an accurate representation of how I'm feeling. <laughs> Does this low key feel like the setting of Twilight? <laughs> I feel like some werewolves or vampires could come running out at any moment now. <laughs> More creepy crawlies. I literally took a bath yesterday afternoon and um, it's probably not even before 9.30 a.m. yet and I'm already absolutely repulsed by my smell the humidity is here and it is making me sweaty <laughs> pretty well the sun is out and the fog is starting to burn off not too bad of a day I don't know if you can see, there's a little garden snake down there. Oh, he's, he's so hard to see because he blends in. Alex near about stepped right on him. She was like two inches away from stepping on him. Not sure why we're signing it, but everybody is. Lunch today. All right, so I think we're only about 1.3 from the border and Birdie and Wes just stopped by their followers and gave us some trail magic, some Rice Krispie treats. So that was super sweet of them. So thank you guys. Little salamander right on trail. Right on 
Hey, buddy. You better be careful out here. You're going to get stepped on. Oh We made it. First impressions of North Carolina, it's windy and it is steep. I mean, I know you can't tell, but oh my. watching the trees sway in the wind. We're kind of protected on this side of the mountain, but the other side is getting it. I think this mountain is actually trying to kill me right now. But this view is unbelievable. It is the end of day 11 and I am at Muskrat Creek Shelter. Um, my total for the day mileage wise is I think 11.8 miles. So um, pretty good distance today. I was definitely feeling it towards the end. The last mile I was just inching my way up. Um, we have a possibility for rain tonight. And then definitely rain tomorrow. I think the high tomorrow is like maybe in the 30s. So rainy and in the 30s, it's going to be cold and gross. So can't say that I'm really looking forward to that. But hopefully it'll be a nice climb and um, nice views and whatnot. So I'll check back with you guys later.